Hello, hello, hi again. Uh, this is Pastor Nella Mobzei, and uh, today I'm going to uh, make a video on uh, why life is like YouTube. Now, uh, for those of you who have watched uh, why I was single and unavailable, uh, I was surprised and amazed by um, how many views it got, and uh, it had likes, and it had one dislike. Now yesterday someone uh, got to me and said, Pastor, your video, um, it had, you know, almost 50 likes, but there was one dislike. And this person seemed so bothered that someone couldn't like the video, right? And I couldn't, I was trying to understand where she was coming from and everything. And, you know, I think for her, she was so passionate. She loved the video that she was hoping that everyone you know loves the video too but it didn't happen and she was bothered that he had one dislike but what bothered her the most is how it didn't bother me and she kept saying but why is it not bothering you pastor and i said because whenever you put something out there expect people to like it but also expect people to not like it because that's how life is. There are people who are going to like you and the people who are not going to like you. You know, there are people who are going to understand your, your ministry. There are people who are not going to understand your ministry. There are people who are going to support your gift and talent and the people who are not going to support you, your gift and talent. For example, look at um, Beyonce or Nicki Minaj or all those artists. No matter how uh, popular the song is, when you go on YouTube, there are people who didn't like it. You know, and, and that's how life is. You know, that's how life because life is like YouTube it's, it's a place where anybody comes and put everything out there there are people who put videos of dogs of cute babies laughing there are people who are putting stuff about sport I mean you could see every weird kind of things on YouTube but what uh, she didn't understand is why it didn't bother me and the thing is that the reason why it didn't bother me is that no matter how much I'm gonna say this no matter how much that person disliked it it does not change the power of the message just because someone doesn't like you it does not change the value of who you are you know just because someone does not support your gift does not support your dreams does not support your vision does not support your project it does not mean that your project as you are useless it just happens that people are not the right people for you maybe the person who didn't like it didn't like it because the message wasn't for them maybe they didn't agree with the things I said and we have to understand that at the end of the day in life not everybody's going to agree with us and we have to learn how to be okay with that we can can't always leave to you know please everyone <laughs> you know you can uh, always leave to, for applause you know you have to understand that the video I made I made it to inspire people but also did it for the glory of God you know like when you start leaving to say that I'm doing this for God I'm doing this to glorify God yes there are people who are going to understand what I'm doing but there are people also who are not going to understand what I'm doing and that's perfectly fine and that's perfectly fine like you have to learn how to be okay because sometimes you're going to hear negative comments just like you're going to hear ne uh, positive comments and that's what YouTube is like you know you you, you may see a cute uh, video of a baby with chubby you know and then you find there are negative comments about it you may see a cute video of puppies and cats and there are people who dislike it and that's life you know that's life that's that's the world we live in you know that there are people who are not always going to like what you do there are people who are not going to you know always and there are a lot of people out there who are afraid you know to put themselves out there they're afraid what if people are gonna dislike me what if people are not gonna like me what if I hear negative comments but what if you get likes what if you get good comments you know I mean at the end of the day, not everyone is going to understand you, not everyone is going to support you, and not everybody's going to um, see the greatness in you, and it's okay. You know, I think there is this idea that we got from society that we have to accept that everybody's going to like us, not everybody's going to like us, you know, uh, even me, I'm sure there are a lot of people who can stand me. Now, does that bother me? No. 
you know. And a lot of people are so afraid to leave because they're so afraid of people out there, people they don't even know because, you know, it takes courage to put stuff on YouTube, you know, because sometimes you don't know how people are going to react to it, you know, and and a lot of people, lot are, of afraid. people are afraid to leave, they're, you know, they're afraid of what people are going to think, are going to say, you know, a lot of people are afraid to try, they're afraid to get the things that they have in them outside because, you know, they're afraid of people they don't even know, you know, and sometimes you have to learn the voices that matters, you know, because yes, YouTube is a place that is very scary, just like life, you know, it's a very scary place, you know, there are people who judge you without knowing you. A lot of people are afraid to leave because they're afraid of what other people are going to say about what they try, you know, what they do, and, you know, and I think life is like YouTube. Some people are going to like what you do, some are not going to like what you do, but at the end of the day, it does not mean that uh, what you're doing is not glorifying God, it doesn't mean that God is not by your side, it doesn't mean that it's your talent, and it is very important that you understand that, you know, that just because you get one rejection, it does not mean that all your life is going to depend on that. And it is So very I will close with this, don't stop leaving because you're afraid of the dislikes and the negative comments. They come with the package. You can run away from that. This was Pastor Honela. God bless you and appreciate the time that you take to watch my videos. And remember, go out there, live your life, glorify God. And the dislike does not mean that what you're doing is not for you. All right? It takes courage to put stuff out there. So don't be afraid to grow, to live, to accomplish your dreams just because of one dislike, just because of one comment. That's life. We learn from that, but we learn how to select what matters and what doesn't matter. Take care. <laughs>